What's up YouTube? It's your boy Silent and today we've got some groundbreaking equipment that we just received from uh, Full Sail University. If many of you didn't know, I'm a film student down there in the digital cinematography program and we finally just got my launch box uh, equipment for the remainder of the second academic year, I believe. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Cue the intro. All right, everybody. So I've already kind of taken most of the stuff out of the boxes they came in just because we had to find a place to put everything. Um, so it's not going to be a really big unboxing, but I've got all the components here laid out in front of me on the, our table here. And so let's just get right into them. We've got the USB-C to SD card reader. Uh, it's probably a little bit hard to see because of the reflection there, but it's from Apple. Uh, USB-C, like I said, SD card reader. The counter to that would be this big envelope here that says memory card. And I believe it's a 64 gig. Yes, yeah, sir, it's a Sony 64 gig uh, E270, 270 megabytes per second. Not bad. Throw that over there. Next, we've got the StageMaster 25 foot XLR cable for the microphone. So. I've never used an XLR microphone before, just a, the Yeti USB mic and currently my iPhone XR. Um, so this will be very exciting and handy to use. 7506 headphones. Sorry about the super good reflection of this window here. Sony professional headphones, uh, monitoring that I'll you know, plug into the camera, I believe, um, to pick up all the sound that we can use for post-production and hear what we sound like. I have a pair of Audio-Technica um, I forget the name of them. 150s? 350s? Mm. I can't recall. But they're in white. But I'll be excited to use these and compare and contrast them. So that'll be super fun. Then we've got some light reflectors. Awesome. We I've got another pack over there somewhere. We've got four. Three? Four? One two, three, four studio lights from same brand, newer, uh, LED and all 660s. Let's see what these guys look like. It's a box, good hardy box. And it's a bag, a bag of box. 40 watt, bicolor 3200 to 5600. Wow, you got your yellow, your white dimmer there. I've never used one of these before. Flippy flappies. Ooh. Hopefully we can put together a stream here eventually and guess what will be featured? These guys. Very exciting stuff. I cannot wait to use them. So mainly this stuff is meant to be for like your school projects or whatever, right? Well, it will be used for that also. Uh, my boy Charles, who you can check out at, I believe it's Blackheart Cinema now, but it was Charles Perez Short Films on YouTube. He's the creator of the Asylum series that got a lot of hits. And uh, you didn't hear it from me. There's something else on the way. So now that we got that, we've got um, the last, well, a couple more things actually. A gigantic Manfrotto bipod, or tripod, not a bipod, tripod. Um, with a handy dandy bag. That's a sturdy, sturdy tripod there. Almost forgot about the stands for the production lights. We've got three of these babies, three or four, I honestly can't remember. And then we've got this handy dandy bag that'll hold mostly everything um, besides like the production lights and the tripod and all that stuff, but it should hold like the um, reflectors all the cables that we have, and the last two items that I'm about to show you. Next on the list, we've got the Sony ECM VG1 shotgun microphone that'll plug into um, the camera that we now have. And that is pretty much the reason why I filmed this video, is because of the camera. Last but not least, ladies and gentlemen, the Sony FS5 
Mark II 4K camera. Wow. This is what I've been waiting for for like the past eight months. I am very excited to get this out of the box put together and use um, for the upcoming series that I am partnering with Charles with. Um, school projects, obviously. And B-roll for, you know, tech reviews and all that stuff that I want to do. Um, but yeah, man, this is, this is the pride and joy now. And I cannot wait to put it together and show you guys what it looks like. Cue time lapse. figure it out. All right, everybody, now that we've got the camera fully assembled and ready to go, let's insert that nice looking B-roll. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. Thanks for watching. Uh, like I said, hopefully we'll be able to implement all this gear into the channel. The class is probably gonna start picking up, so we'll see what happens. Um, but I'll keep trying to upload a video at least once a week. Thanks for watching, everybody. I appreciate all the support. If you don't mind, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.